Around this time of year, potholes are almost impossible to avoid, but with the warmer temperatures coming our way and a lot of snow and rain that we've had in the past couple of days, is the problem going to get even worse? I think over the next couple of weeks and, and going into um, uh, going into early April, uh, we'll probably see a peak number of potholes. Potholes are caused by the expansion and contraction of water underneath the pavement. And when that water freezes, it expands and weakens the ground, causing cracks and potholes. This month has been has been challenging because of having precipitation that then melts and then refreezes and melts again. You have a lot of contracting and expanding and uh, flexing of the road base. After the winter months wreak havoc on our roadways, DPW says it takes months to piece the roads back together. Now that we're not out uh, plowing uh, as we were, it seemed like every every 48 hours or so, um, and the weather seems to have calmed down a little bit, we can get back to, to doing our road repairs. In the past, they've had to use cold patches to fix the potholes, which isn't always the best solution. But now the city of Hartford is equipped with hot patch. With the hot patch, we're able to uh, make a more permanent uh, repair to the potholes. DPW encourages residents to report potholes using the 311 system. We try to drive around and hit the main routes and, and keep our eyes uh, on, on all of our roads, but uh, obviously with uh, you know, with the amount of uh, road surface we have in the city of Hartford, we can't have our eyes on every square inch all the time. So any help we can get from the public in pointing these problem areas out, uh, it just makes it easier and quicker for us to remedy the problem and, and make the road safer for everyone. If you encounter a pothole on the road, experts say you should maintain your car by having the proper tire pressure and also make sure to get your alignment checked regularly. Lauren Zenzi, Fox 61 News.